Hi students, in this video we are going to solve this problem from quadratic equation. Is it possible to design a rectangular park of perimeter 80 meters and area 400 meters square? If so, find the length and breadth and comment on the answer. Comment. Okay. Is it possible to design a rectangular park? Okay rectangular park of perimeter 80 so if length is l breadth is b so this will also be length l this will be b right perimeter is addition of all the four sides l plus l is 2l b plus b is 2b so this is if you take two common 2 into l plus b is perimeter right we have learned this formula in the lower classes what is this given this perimeter is given as 80 80 meters so if you send 2 on the other side, L plus B will be equal to 80 divided by 2, it will be equal to 40. L plus B will be equal to 40. Okay. Now also given area should be 400. Area. We know area of rectangle is L into B. This should be equal to how much? 400 meter square. Okay. L into B. Let us substitute the values of value of L in this. See what is L? We can write 40 minus B, send B on the other side or we can send L on the other side and substitute the value of B in this. Okay. Anyways, we can do. So L we are substituting. This is 40 minus B because L value is 40 minus B. One more B is also there is equal to 400. 40 into B is 40B minus B into B is B square is equal to 400 okay if you send these two terms on this side we'll have 0 b square minus say this is plus right so it will become 40 b minus 40 b plus 400 okay so we have this equation finally we have b square minus 40 b plus 400 is equal to 0 okay if you compare this with standard form ax square plus bx plus c is equal to 0 in place of x we have b here don't get confused so what is a a is 1 b is equal to minus 40 and c is 400 he is asking us to check whether it is possible or not so first we need to find the discriminant b square minus 4ac if this is greater than 0 if this is greater than 0, this equation will have two different roots. Yes, situation is possible. If this is equal to 0, this equation will have two same roots. Even then, the situation is possible. But if this is less than 0, the, this will have imaginary roots. In that case, situation is not possible. Okay. So, let us go ahead and find this value. B square minus 4ac. So, we have minus... 40 whole square minus 4 into 1 into C is how much? 400. 1600 minus this is also 1600. So this will give us 0. So this B square minus 4AC we got it as 0. Which means this equation will have two same roots. Okay. The situation is possible? Yes. Let us find out. Let us find out length and breadth. Okay. I am rubbing this. Okay, now hmm, factors of 400. See, factors of 400 and the middle term should be minus 40. So, 20 and 20 will work, right? See, 20 and 20, minus 20, minus 20 will give us the middle term minus 40. And if we multiply minus 20 and minus 20, we'll have plus 400. Okay, so this is b square minus 20b minus 20b plus 400 is equal to 0. So what can we take common? b we can take common. So this will give us b minus 20 in the brackets. Whatever we get inside the brackets, we should write it one more time, right? b minus 20 is equal to 0 outside the brackets minus 20. So we have b minus 20, b minus 20 is equal to 0. So same roots, right? equal to 0 will come here. So this is B is equal to 20. B is equal to 20. Okay. Breadth is 
20 we got all right now let me just rub this part also okay now see here breadth is 20 okay how should we find value of l length see here length is 40 minus b b is how much 20 so this 40 minus 20 is also equal to 20 so both length and breadth are 20 each so here in the last hit asks us to comment okay so what can we say is it actually a rectangle no it is in fact a square right is the situation possible yes so thank you so much for watching the video i hope you understood this